If you're wondering how to make cauliflower wings, this is how you do it using meal spice. You make a batter, season with chicken style seasoning and the Caribbean all purpose seasoning. If you want that umami taste, you gotta use the chicken style and the Caribbean in there. And to take it to another level, add the brand new tropical seasoning in there. Mm -mm -mm. Let me tell y'all, you're gonna love it. The children are going to love it. The whole family is going to love it. Did y'all get your meal spice seasoning yet? What are you waiting for? www.tastyeden.com Listen y'all, you're going to bite your finger after trying this. You add some ranch to the side and y'all gonna be surprised. Greetings, everybody. Greetings, greetings, greetings. How are you doing? I, I, I pray that you are doing well. That's right. Yes, yes, yes. We are so very happy to be with you. We are extremely happy. This is the Brennies here with you. Uh, I am so excited. I'm, I, I, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say. We, we are excited to be here. Yes, we have a wonderful, very, very interesting uh presentation yes. uh, for you folks today so wherever you're watching us from we welcome you again this uh, the, the, my, my name is mark and this is Mills. this is the brennies with you here at this moment from eden tasty eden we are so happy once again to be able to uh, uh have this special program let me tell you if you have questions don't be afraid to put them in the chat that's number one we're gonna have um we, a, a special uh, special guest. Yeah, we have spe we'll have a special guest. We're gonna have discounts mm -hmm. right now as we speak on our website, and we have uh, our special guest. I can't wait. You know, uh, she has some good stuff that she's going good to. Good stuff. Uh, she's gonna start making us hungry. Yeah. Oh yes, 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 yes. <laughs> so, um, I'm 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 just so excited uh, for this. So, uh, Saints, welcome again. Wherever you're watching us from, we're happy to have you with us, and we praise God for this opportunity so um without further ado let's welcome yes we're gonna welcome here our good friend our very very good friend sister candace, candace. hey <laughs> uh, how are you doing i'm, I'm hungry but i'm good <laughs> yeah <laughs> You didn't tell us you were hungry. <laughs> no, I'm, it's like, you know, I'm so excited and I'm trying not to eat anything before it's time and just allow everything to happen. So, but I'm excited. I'm happy. Y'all are making me feel like a chef. Mm, it's all great product. Mm. So, yeah, I'm good. I'm blessed. You're a chef. You're you a look chef. like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. And we are so excited, really. Uh, to have you on here with us, uh, Candice. So before you get to the cooking part, which is mm -hmm. the the reason you know most people are here and watching, we have people watching from many different platforms right now. So people are happy to see you. Mm -hmm. They want to know some things. Um, first, uh, you know, a little bit about yourself. You know, for now, not too much. You know, uh, just a little bit. You know, for those watching who may not be. Uh, you know, maybe wondering uh, who who are we talking to here with. So, why don't you tell us just a little about yourself, sis? Okay, so my name is Candice Bailey. Recently, Bailey. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm married to Nicholas Bailey. I'm now. I'm from Trinidad and Tobago, from the south of the island and Trinidad. Mm -hmm. I know a lot of persons watching. You all from Trinidad. Hello to you all. And um. I was previously a drama teacher in Trinidad until God had other plans and I migrated here. I'm in Florida right now, married, doing ministry, and most of my work is surrounding helping women to live better lives, have um, a better health, because we know a lot of them go through a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, March is actually a month dedicated to women's health, so endometriosis, um, a lot of awareness. So that's where I love to be, and that's why I'm so happy for this product because a lot of us suffer because our gut health is bad, mm -hmm. and it's because of the ingredients we use. So I 
basically help women get closer to God, um, get stronger in their spirituality, and be better wives. Amen. Because that's like a big ministry by itself. It um, is big. I'm very, yeah, I'm very passionate about God, and I'm passionate about keeping this body healthy. Amen. So, um, yeah, I am the second child of five children, and I am very happy for... You know, everything God has done in my life thus far, I'm an educator at heart. So mm. I'm always about letting people know the benefits of using a healthier option. So that's why I'm here today. Amen. That's good. Yes, that's <laughs> awesome. That's awesome. I mean, a, a other alternative, especially for those who are health conscientious, this is, you can't go wrong with that. Mm -hmm. So we, yeah. we're happy, you know, to hear what you're doing in the community and the Lord is using you to help others. And that's, that's a blessing. So we thank you for that. Yes. Yeah, so how did you come across Mio Spice? Mm -hmm. Ha, uh -huh. <laughs> so it started with me going to a medical missionary course. Mm -hmm. um, for those who don't know what that is, it's basically using God's way of using natural remedies and herbs in the curing process and the healing process. Mm -hmm. And um, so I started there when I realized the stuff that I was eating and putting in my body, I was like, oh my gosh, God, what am I going to do? Mm. I remember coming home and I was literally crying because I was feeling so overwhelmed. Mm. I'm like, God, should I just fast until you come? Because <laughs> everything I... And um, so, yeah, everything I eat, it has an effect on your body, your brain, your blood. And I just wanted to make sure that I was giving myself the best chance at life. So That's I went right. and I prayed and I said, Lord... I don't know what to do. Um, my diet before, it seemed very easy. I live a very busy life. You need to help me out here. Mm -hmm. So I prayed that prayer. And a couple of days after, I saw in a group chat, Tasty Eden. I was like, <laughs> Tasty Eden? At first, I thought they were making the meals, selling it to your home. <laughs> 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 and then I figured out it was, you know, this great plant-based um, seasoning. Mm -hmm. And I said to myself, okay, there are th two things with eating healthy. It's either it's bland or you are not. You run out of recipes. Yeah. So when this came to mind, I was like, wait, I could just take all the good stuff I want to eat, find a natural replacement, mm -hmm. and season it up. Mm -hmm. So that is my prayer and how I stumbled upon it. And I didn't know something like this existed because I said, you need MSG, of course. What do you, how are you going to get the flavor? Mm. You need to have certain preservatives and coloring <laughs> to give it the color and the spice it needs. Mm -hmm. And then I realized, no, if God wants us to live healthy, there must be a way for us to do it with the natural stuff and still get the same effect. That's right. So that's how I stumbled upon it. And I kid you not, your wife, it would know. I was like, I said, Lord, I don't even have a credit card. How am I going to do this? <laughs> I was like, do they sell it in a store? Where is it? So then when I saw the website, I, I immediately, you know, WhatsApp and I said, hey, I really want to get this. How can I get this? And you all were so friendly and helpful. You said, here's what, we'll do the order for you. We'll send all the instructions in an email and you'll take it from there. And when my husband came home, I was like, I don't care what you say. We need to spend the money and get this. <laughs> I said, because he likes healthy meals too, you know? That's good. And, uh, that's good. My husband is Jamaican and I'm Trini. So that's like a whole set of different flavors mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. trying to be compatible. <laughs> so that's why we need a lot of help, mm -hmm. you know, to make sure that things taste good. So yeah. um, he came home, he did all the transactions. And in a couple of days, I saw the box and I knew it was for me. <laughs> <laughs> I got the box and I said, you know what? I was telling my mother-in-law, I don't like to use the word mother-in-law, so I call her mother-in-love. So mm -hmm. I was like, mother-in-love, come. We're going to unbox this together. So I went on my Instagram 
opened the box and I was like, mommy, what we could use with this? What we could use with this? <laughs> and she's the cook. She's a really good cook. So, mm-hmm. you know, she was like, Candice, we could do tofu. We could do, um, and she started to list out a whole set of stuff. And I got excited and that's, and I tagged you all and that's where we connected. Mm-hmm. So, I heard, I heard she loves cabbage. I heard, I saw yes. that. <laughs> she loves her cabbage. <laughs> And um yeah, it she she actually did some buffalo cauliflower. Mm, right? mm, and oh. I, like it was so tasty. Delicious. Like I I had to say a prayer to leave some for my husband because I wanted to eat <laughs> the <to> share. <laughs> but she taught me how to do it. So you know, I tried to, you know, mix and match. And then I saw you all doing a recipe with mushrooms. Mm. So I was like, I went and I was like, I need these oyster mushrooms. And I was like, looking, looking all over for it. I see white mushroom. I see a different type. And I was like, okay, oyster, I found you. You mm-hmm. were right bottom of the shelf. So yeah, I just got on this craze and said, you know what? I'm going to try something different. And what I love about God is that when he sees your effort, mm-hmm. he like provides and he makes yeah. provision for you yes. to connect with the right persons, find the right products. And yeah, a lot of it is research and prayer. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that's how I stumbled upon this brand. Yeah. The Lord answered your prayers, Candice. <laughs> yes, yes. He certainly did. You, you can definitely, uh, I definitely agree with that. So, praise the Lord. Now, the Lord. what are you going to cook for us today? Well, even before well, that, even before that, even before that, what have been your experience? What have, you know, what have your experience been uh, uh, with Tasty Eden so far? You know, some of the things you cook, you know, how has it been so far? So, what I realized is that... Um, because I have been shifting my diet over the course of the four, uh, past few months, it's like my my taste buds and my brain is like a sensor and a detector. Mm. So if I eat something outside, it will go it will go off and say, "Hey, MSG is there." Mm. And I realized that sometimes my skin would itch, and I was like, "I wonder if it's like the detergent or something." And I was like. Hmm, let me do process of elimination. And I realized that there are certain things, not just in the seasonings, but um, in some of the products that mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, we purchase, it has an effect on your mm-hmm. blood and then it itches your skin. Mm-hmm. So I decided, let me try this product. And since I've tried it, I don't have headaches. Mm. I don't feel... You know, sometimes you eat a meal and you, some meals, you know, you feel healthier after mm. and other meals, you feel like, oh, this feels like junk. Yes, mm. yes. I know exactly I, what you mean. Yep. Yeah, I don't feel like that. When I when I use these products, it helps me not to use other additives because everything is already complete in these um, seasonings so that it makes me go less on salt. It makes, because everything is already there and it makes me go less on the other Caribbean flavors that I'm accustomed to that is packed with other things. Mm-hmm. So I feel I feel lighter, I feel healthier, and I realize my skin is not as irritated as before. Oh. So I thank God for that. Oh. Um, yeah, and what I realize too, sometimes when I eat, probably an hour and a half after, I have like really bad stomach issues. Mm-hmm. I haven't been having stomach issues. Um, my bowel movement is different because mm-hmm. the food is being digested differently. Mm-hmm. It's, it's like going through a whole different process. Right. And my body, my body and my cells, they are like saying, hey, we got some renovation done. Something is different. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You know, so um, I thank God for it. And I am curious to like try different recipes to see how things taste so that I could you know, not just prepare for myself, but prepare for my family. Right. Because, you know, some people will be like, huh, where, where's, where's the meat? Where's the, <laughs> where's the other flavoring? Did you use this? Did you use this pack, that pack? And I was saying to myself, okay, when I try this, they must be able to say, hey, she didn't do anything different or even it tastes better. Mm-hmm. So that's where I'm at in the entire journey. Yeah, that's good. Amen, amen, amen. amen. 
Now, which one? Which one is your favorite? You have a favorite? Do you, Do based you on what one? you've used so far, is there one that you think you like the better than the others? What do you so think? I have I have two runner ups. Mm. It was hard to choose a favorite, and those are the two that I'm using today. All mm -hmm. right. And that's the best, the mm -hmm. premium seasoning, and this tropical one. Mm -hmm. This tropical one makes me feel like. You know, back home where we have our kitchen garden and you just take everything fresh and you dice it up. <laughs> yeah. So I miss home a lot. So this this feels like home and that's what I'm using. Of course, I love all the other stuff, and but they have different purposes. Mm -hmm. Right. So if I'm doing um if I'm doing the tofu, I would use the all purpose seasoning and there's the chicken, the chicken style one. Mm -hmm. Right, I will use I will use these two here. That's the right. Oil, the That's chicken what I used style. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. This and this. And what I found is that um, when I use these two, I don't have to use much turmeric because this have a kind of yeah richness to it. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yep. And it feels really good. And this, I just use this for general cooking, so mm -hmm. I could sprinkle some of this on the rice. Mm -hmm. Um, like all the light stuff. I use this, the low but for the mm -hmm. heavy lifting, I use these two. I see. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. You can I use them in, in a similar way. Yeah. I use those two you mentioned also for tofu. Mm -hmm. I use them too. Pretty and good. And it's pretty good too. And it come out awesome. Yeah. Like this morning, my daughter make, made tofu. Yeah. This tofu was Ugh, oh was yeah good yeah. <laughs> oh yeah it was i'll tell you man I, I keep saying this you know people keep saying how you know they don't like tofu i'm telling you it's how you make it mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes it's how you make it and what you use and i'm telling you folks out there yeah. listen now we, we're about to get to the cooking because mm -hmm. you know that's really, you know, the, the highlight of this. <laughs> but before we get to it, uh, no, I, I, I was going to ask you, um, like, would you recommend this to others? I'll leave these questions at the end yeah. after you do the cooking. So we're going to get to the cooking. So while our sister here is getting ready uh, to do the cooking, let me um, just remind everybody, okay? Uh, let me just remind everybody that um, we, we, we right now running a, a promotion mm -hmm. for those of you watching right now. If you try the if you try the meal spice, okay, and you like it, uh, you can make sure that you never run out. Mm -hmm. You know, you can make sure you never run out, and cause and and the good thing is too, you, uh, I mean, you're gonna have seasonings in your cabinet anyway. Think about it, all ladies, you know, in the kitchen, you're gonna have seasonings anyway. Oh yes, we do. So you might as well get something that you know you can trust, like as far as what's in it, you know, you it's not gonna have anything harmful for your body. And what you can do is you can subscribe. Yeah. Yeah. Right now we're gonna run this promotion uh, uh, um, all Hello. the way until uh, it's gonna be all the way until tomorrow. Tomorrow. At uh, what time? At the same time here. Same time we have now, tomorrow one o'clock. We're gonna have the opportunity to subscribe and save. Uh, like we have many discount layer on top of layer of mm -hmm. discounts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So go on the website uh, tastyeden.com. Go check it out. Go check it out. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the option to uh, subscribe is there. And right now, for those uh, of you watching right now, there's that we're running that special, so you can um, uh, make sure you don't miss this great opportunity. So you have a monthly option. You have a monthly option where it gets shipped to you automatically. Yeah. Uh, and actually, you can do that on on Amazon as well. You can do it on our website. You can do it on Amazon, mm -hmm. where you you subscribe and it gets delivered to you automatically every month. Remember, you don't have to do go to, to through the hassle. Go on the website you don't and, have and, to. and 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 yeah. and you know it uh, comes straight to you. Order so. And let's say okay, so let's say you selected three different seasonings, right? And then you subscribe, and then you figure no, there are <laughs> other two I would like to try and sit. We can switch your subscription where mm -hmm. we add different uh, products in it so what do they have to do do they have to do it online or they call the number or they, they they do it themselves, they do it on themselves. The, or okay. if they're not comfortable doing it mm -hmm. they can send an email and we uh, we can switch it out for them customer service can switch it out for them yeah. with no problem so uh you can do that uh you can get it monthly or bi-monthly depending on how long it takes you for your seasoning to uh uh to run out Mm -hmm. Right for you know for to run out, so you, you can do monthly and bi monthly, Depends and you on can much, subscribe. How much the person cook too? Yeah. Depending on how much you cook, mm -hmm. yeah, you can even uh, run out faster. Yeah. Um. So, 
you can let's say you tried it you tried it and you didn't like it you can cancel anytime mm-hmm. uh, no penalty you can cancel yeah. anytime you want so that's the subscription so listen Mark, let's get back to the cooking let's get back oh, yes, yes, cooking, yes, cooking. Yes, yes, cooking 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 <laughs> all, all right, right. <laughs> okay candice so. tell us tell us what you're cooking yeah t- talk to all us all right so today is some exciting stuff and um i went ahead and prepared these so mm. this mm. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay i'm trying this mm. is the veggie ball Ooh. right so it's all plant based right um you have your seeds you have your um peas grinded mm. and mixed up here with um of course mm. this is seasoned on it the best the premium seasoning and just to let you all know that inside here we have sea salt we have mm-hmm. granulated garlic to give it a nice flavor we have granulated onion, parsley, flake, sage. We have oregano and we have some spices mixed up in here. Mm-hmm. So I use, so what I did is um, I put the balls together and I sprinkle some of the best seasoning over it. And then I use the tropical complete seasoning because I wanted to give it that kick and that spice. Mm-hmm. So I just made sure. And I know it was strong because, like, I smell the flavor as soon as I popped it open. Mm-hmm. And um, what I love about this, it has paprika and thyme. Mm-hmm. And those are what I call the deep seasonings. Mm-hmm. They go deep with it. Tropical. So, mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, so what we do, um, back in Trinidad, we call it kusume. Mm. So kusume stands for making it soak, making it marinate. Mm-hmm. So I let it sit for like about 30 minutes so all the flavors are ab- absorbed. And then I use some of my I use some of my natural vegan earth balance butter mm-hmm. and I put this in the air fryer because I didn't want it to stick and I wanted all the flavors to be absorbed. Mm-hmm. And what the butter does it allows, it almost like it opens the pores of the mm-hmm. meatballs, the veggie meatballs, and all the seasoning goes straight up inside. Ooh. So I put some of that, and then I I, I kind of try to look a little chef-like. So I put some, <laughs> um, some spinach leaves there, and I have some um, seasoning in the center here, yeah. and that's that. So oh yeah, good. it looks good. Just make sure you send mine when, when we're done, okay? <laughs> 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 yes, and right now in the oven, which I'm going to stop right now because it was making while we were setting up, mm-hmm. I did some seasoned potatoes. Back home, we call it garlic potatoes. Mm-hmm. So this is what it looks like. Uh-huh. Right? Oh, very similar. What, what did you put in there? So... I boiled the potatoes for about 10 to 15 minutes mm-hmm. to give me a head start and to just keep that, um, to keep it, you know, in that cooked state. And then I place some olive oil mm-hmm. on the potatoes and then I sprinkle my two best friends. Mm-hmm. I sprinkle them all over and I mixed it up to make sure it's all covered. Mm-hmm. And then what I did was, let me grab, get this. This is some plant-based shredded mm-hmm. cheese, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. I sprinkle some on it because, you know, everybody want that nice um, taste. But these two basically did everything that it had. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. So I use some of this on top to give it that nice, um, you know, flavor. And then I, I topped it off with this. Mm. And then I put it in to bake. Okay, I learned something new today that? again. Wow. wow. But now I'm going to make my stir fry um, veggies and show you all. Okay. So what I did, I went ahead and I cut up my um, my broccoli and my cauliflower. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. So I make sure I cut it up and I didn't boil it. I steamed it so that it doesn't lose its firmness. Mm-hmm. And now what I'm going to do is, I like to season stuff before, right? Mm-hmm. And then mm-hmm. add, so I do it in two parts. 
So I season a little bit before, and then I season a little bit coming down to the end of the cooking process yes. to make sure nobody is left out. Yes, Chef so, Candice, you yes, get it right. Yes. <laughs> so I'm putting the fire on a low. I'm putting it on a low fire, mm -hmm. and I have my frying pan right here. And what I did is that. Sometimes if you if you put olive oil in your frying pan, what it can do, it um it can have a kind of adverse effect. So what you want to do is you wanna sprinkle a little on whatever you're frying first so that it, it doesn't um there's a word I'm looking for, but just trust me, this way is really good. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> let's so see. What I'm going to do is um it's heating up right now. You put um, butter in um, there? Is that butter is some yeah, earth yes. balance? Okay. I put some of the butter mm -hmm. just to give it that nice flavor. Uh, you know, flavor mm -hmm. and golden look. And then I put a little bit of the organic um coconut liquid um amino season mm -hmm. because I wanted to give it that kind of Chinese style stir fry. Okay. Feeling, right? And now I'm going to use my best friends, right? Mm -hmm. so, I use the side that has the holes so I could measure how much I'm putting. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to throw some on them while the pot is warming, the frying pan is warming up. So I put some there and I shake it up. Mm -hmm. And of course, the olive oil that was there before is going to let it stick to the broccoli mm -hmm. and the cauliflower. And I'm going to put some of my tropical seasoning. And this is going to give me the color and the spice that I need. So one, he works on the flavoring. They both work on flavoring, but this one here, mm -hmm. right? The um, tropical complete seasoning, it gives you that complete fla flavor you need. Okay. So now that it's hot, I'm going to gradually put them in. Woo! I hear it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Mm, that's going to be good. That's going to taste so good. Wow. I'm going to make sure, and I will show you a bit here. Mm -hmm. This is what it looked like. You said you steamed, you steamed it before you started, yes. right? Okay. And so I now, steamed it before. How so long are you going to do this? It's to cook long. Mm -hmm. Right. So are you going to cover it and let it steam again in the butter or how you... I'm just going to, now that it's here a little bit, mm -hmm. I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit of the seasonings again, mm -hmm. just to make sure it gets on top. And then I'm going to let cover it and let it simmer for a bit. Mm -hmm. And as it sweats, I will know that, okay, it's been to the gym and it's good. <laughs> <laughs> Is this going to be your lunch today? Yes, it's going to be my lunch. Oh. And what I decided to do also is we cook with a lot of fresh seasoning as well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So to bring out the flavoring that is already there in the seasoning that we just threw. Let me just put this here. So what I did, I diced up some onion, garlic, mm -hmm. and we call it side, you all call it scallion. Yeah. And I'm oh. just going to mix it in. Because you want to get that nice garlic flavor. Yes. And then the spices from my mm -hmm. friend, mm -hmm. it's going to come alive. So this fresh season is going to bring it, bring it all together now. Oh, yeah. We know what we're talking about. We mm. do cook with a lot of fresh yeah. um, seasonings, too. We... We we Haitians we sometimes blend them mm -hmm. and we put them in the fridge and every time we're cooking we use a little bit of it we use a little bit of it yes. <laughs> yeah and we yeah, still we use the seasoning. yeah we still we still use fresh too every time garlic oh we use a lot of garlic lots of garlic to cook it just bring out the flavor it just give a different vibe mm -hmm. when you put garlic yes. And what I do is there's some remaining here, so I put a little water, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just not too much, so that it gives it a nice little steam going on there. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna grab the cover and cover it, mm -hmm. and it's gonna give us all the good flavors we need. 
Oh, I'm sure some people that are watching, they they are hungry too. Let yeah. us know how, yeah. how. What do you think? Y- yes, yes, yes. Everywhere you watch, wherever you're watching us from, tell us. You know, it, it's it's good to see uh, different folks using it differently. Mm-hmm. You know, that tells you how uh, versatile the, these 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 things are. Oh, look at this. Oh, wow. The and color. It so good. I smell it too. <laughs> so, what I'm going to do while that is happening, I am going to, y'all are going to plate with me the, um, the seasoned potatoes or the garlic potatoes. All right. So, since before we started, I basically I greased the pan with some olive oil, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Some olive oil. And then I put these these really good friends together, okay. season it up. And what I like, you can actually see the seasoning still remaining on the potatoes. Mm-hmm. So, so we have our veggies, we have our vegan meatballs, and we have our potatoes. Okay. Oh, I know a lot of people that are, the, the viewers will be hungry. You'll make, you'll make them feel hungry right now <laughs> because this look, it looks so good. Yeah, it, it, it's, 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 uh, these are the finished products of the potatoes. Mm. Yes. Wow. Tell me, I'm going to start calling out names here. People that I'm seeing here. Uh, I see Smana, Smana. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking Smana is hungry. I think she's probably going to do that. She's probably going to think, Hey man, I should. I'm yeah, gonna I'm gonna do it this way too. <laughs> yeah, because you know, like like you say, who else is watching here? <laughs> yeah, once they put in something in the chat, we'll find out. Yeah, yeah, and let us know where you're watching us from, mm-hmm. uh, and then we can see it, and uh, yeah, we can uh, uh, we can give you a special greeting. And don't forget, while she's preparing this uh, wonderful dish, uh, while she's preparing this, I'm gonna remind you all again about the. Uh, uh, the subscription that we have currently right now that mm-hmm. you can do, okay? And if you, we, you can also call, you can call 423-567-0568. Uh, uh, mm-hmm. You can call that number and you can place your on uh, order over the phone as well. Uh, you can do that. So if you are more comfortable, if you're more, if you're more comfortable uh, doing it over the phone, we can do that. All right. Mm-hmm. There's many different ways to do it. Uh, and again, these are available as well on Amazon. For those of you, you know, who have Amazon accounts, uh, these are available on Amazon. So you can. That's another option you have. You can buy them from there as well. Okay. Okay. And what I want to share with people is that. Some people might say, wow, she's been cooking for years. No, today is confession time. So, <laughs> I grew up, confession is good for the soul, by the way. So I grew up with five, um, four other siblings, and I have one sister. She's four years younger than I am. Mm-hmm. But we had to split the chores. So somebody had to choose to cook, and somebody had to choose to clean. So guess which one I choose? You chose to clean. <laughs> I chose to clean, so it was... It was between two C's, the cooking and the cleaning. So <laughs> I wanted to be Cinderella and do all the cleaning while my sister, you know, figure out how to make tasty food. And she ended up being a chef. Wow. So oh wow. She has been showing me stuff and be and I'm five months married now. So of course, after a while I had to realize, hey Candace. You see those same meals you're cooking all the time? You have to step things up. Yes. And these flavoring, these seasonings, really helped me step things up, and I feel like a chef. And mm. I feel so much more confident in the kitchen right now. Yeah, It's like you knew I was going to ask you that question, yeah, how long you've awesome. been cooking, because it doesn't look like you just started you something it, that no. you knew to. Of course. You know, if you didn't say that. Wow. No, it's very, very new, and... um. I really enjoy it because when you see your husband smiling and saying, wow, uh-huh. this is good. Yes. <laughs> you know, that I didn't get any help from his mom, that's a good feeling. Yeah, it is. Mom, I love you still, you know. You can still teach me stuff. <laughs> <laughs> wow, so, it's looking good. So basically, my broccoli and cauliflower is finished because you don't want to get, you don't want to burn out the minerals mm-hmm. because 
when we sweat, we, we get rid of the good stuff that we need. So we need to replenish it. So I am complete. So this is what the potatoes look like. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So wait, Candice, let me ask you a question. Are you going to eat that all that? <laughs> You're so not going to give I... me some? <laughs> <laughs> I'm cooking for the family, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to plate the broccoli so you all can see it. Yes. In all its yeah, and you know yeah. what someone said here? Smana said, listen, mouth watering, <laughs> and you know I love garlic. <laughs> <laughs> and they said, are the meatballs, what is it? Are the meatballs? Are, are they pre-made? No, pre she bought She oh. bought. She bought them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she she bought them, and... and, uh, and uh, seasoned she seasoned them mm -hmm. you know when they sell them they're not seasoned really the way you want to so you have to season them mm -hmm. as well make, make them look uh, exactly how you would how you would how you would have it so again saying we just want to take this time to uh, uh just want to take this time right now uh, encourage you wherever you're watching wherever you're watching us from to uh uh give us a like uh subscribe yeah um Share it. Share yes. this video with others. Mm -hmm. that's, that's important. That's very important to share with others because uh, we believe, you know, as we try, as we grow, as we grow in this community, we believe this is gonna be blessing to other people. You know, I've I've, I've spoken to many people who have uh, purchased uh, the seasoning, and you know, they're very impressed mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. the light, the taste of it. Because what happened is over time we it's we make it better and better and better. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, over time, he's gotten, he has okay. gotten, he has gotten better and better and better over time. So, def definitely, we, um, we, we're happy. We're happy that, uh, you know, we're getting all this ni nice, nice feedback. Well, yeah, yeah, me. Yes, we can hear you. Do you know, do you know the internet was so hungry, it just cut off? <laughs> <laughs> internet was hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Let me... Oh, well. yeah. I am now going to, I'm going to see if I can get back on a device, but in the meantime, I'm going to keep sharing with you all. I think the last thing I heard was about the meatballs, right? Yeah. yeah. So, so these, so because I knew I had to be on the show today, I needed something quick. Mm -hmm. So, um, you can make your meatballs with, with lentil peas and chickpeas and carrots and beets, but I got beyond beef. Now, disclaimer, beyond beef, right, even though it's a very good product, we want to eventually go to as natural as possible mm -hmm. because sometimes um, sometimes the soy and the different products that I use, it can, it can spike our estrogen level. And as women, mm -hmm. we want to stay away from that. I'm not saying this to scare you, but I'm just saying that there are ways, there are more natural, if that's a word, mm -hmm. <laughs> more natural ways to make your meatballs. But I use Beyond Beef. Um, they don't come seasoned. So that is why we needed the seasoning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? So um, I see my internet is back on and I want to, I'm going to switch soon, but I'm going to keep talking until that time. Okay. So right now I'm plating the it is. broccoli and cauliflower. Mm -hmm. So that's where it is. And I'm not going to lie to you all. I think this might be the best thing <laughs> I've made in a while. Uh, there and you go. No, it does look good. It does look good. It looks good. Yeah. And I'm sure it yeah. tastes good too. Yeah, I'm going to... I feel I'm going to ask somebody around here to taste it. And you know... Oh, yeah. yeah. Have that. somebody taste it. Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. a great idea. But, uh, because they might be shy so they will just you'll just hear their voice sure that's that's good that's good for us okay as, so let me i'm gonna join yeah no problem as you yeah as you as you're doing this as you yeah can you go ahead and and, and fix it and um no that's, that's not a problem at all go ahead and fix it uh so saint again uh we want to encourage you all we uh, our purpose is to make sure we have the seasonings and in, in your cabinet okay and you can try them. You can use there's there's different ways, you know. 
again, you can order different with different ways. Or if you more, some people have accounts with um, they have Prime with uh, Amazon. Some folks who have Prime with Amazon, uh, they, they 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 go straight to Amazon and get it. You can get it from that way mm-hmm. or go on the website. You get you can get it. And by the way, uh, if you're in the uh, College Dale area. Mm-hmm. If you are in the uh, College Dale area, we are uh, going to be uh, this Friday. We'll have a li- live demonstration uh, tasting that we're going to be doing at the um, Village Market. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, so uh, we we encourage uh, we we encourage you to come out. Uh, we encourage you to come out and uh, come support. You know, we we look forward to it. Uh, we appreciate the support. I- Yep, so yep. Oh, she got something on here. There it is. Wow. So, I'm going to grab a fork and let my cousin taste it, and you will hear her voice in the background. All right, no problem. Uh-oh. Just a little bit. Okay, mm. so she's going to have her yeah. folks or her people over there tasting. So my cousin, mm-hmm. my cousin, she's, she's my um eldest female cousin, and she grew us up as little children, mm-hmm. my sisters and I. And she is the cook. Mm. So if I pass this test, it's like, <laughs> I'm good. All right. <laughs> so I'm going to look for a really nice piece. This is the potato. Mm-hmm. And you always hear her voice so she could come close by and taste the potato. Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so they can hear you. Okay, this time is going to be an A+. Plus. Oh! 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 <laughs> and I love the addition of that uh, plant-based cheese. It's awesome. Mm. <laughs> you got it. You got it, Candice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was a lot of it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And I'm going to taste it now, right? So I'm going to have the broccoli. It's still keeping its structure, it's not limb or anything, so mm-hmm. guys mm-hmm. you all need to take a flight, mm-hmm. like right now <laughs> oh. oh wow listen, listen yeah, see, it's so good that you're taking a second ba- bite, yeah, I know I, I noticed right? that, mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. I'm tasting I'm tasting the flavors mm-hmm. coming together and I want to eat it with some potato. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oof. Good stuff. Okay, Candice. Okay. Yeah, rich. She's definitely making Oof. folks hungry up here. It's rich. Mmm. <laughs> it's rich and a lot of flavor. Mm. Like, like you all. I don't know if you can see this. But look at all that. Oh, season. yeah. Mm-hmm, look mm-hmm, color. Mm-hmm, I love mm-hmm, it. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah, we can see it. It's it's not too salty, mm-hmm. not too spicy. Very, very. Mm-hmm. The potato is to perfection, and it tastes ah a plus. Yummy. And and you know the good <laughs> thing about this is again like you like you mentioned earlier, you you, you don't have to make compromise on your mm-hmm. health mm-hmm. to to eat something that's good. You know, something that's, that's tasty like this, you don't need to necessarily have to make any compromising on your health. She can't wait. Look at it. You ready for this one? Yep. Yes. This one, you could have went straight in. Oh. The way you were explaining it, I know it would. Mm-hmm. 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 The way she made it, yeah. 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 It's like the flavor went straight to my brain and was like, <laughs> we are here. And we... You mm. are? Ooh. The only thing, though, is that I think I got too excited and I put a little too much seasoning. Mm-hmm. So it's like it absorb and it soak up everything. It's a little bit salty, mm-hmm. but not overbearing where it's choking you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I could tell... I can tell the flavor is there. Mm-hmm. It's it's there. It's there. So y'all, make sure measure out. I think because of this, I'm not sure if in the process of making it, they already have their salt. Mm. So you wanna make sure and put that. So this, the all-purpose low sodium, mm-hmm. you may want to try that with this brand because mm-hmm. what that will do, 
if this already has salt in its packaging, probably pink Himalayan salt or Celtic salt, this is just going to give it the seasoning it needs yep. with all the extra salt. That's right. Mm -hmm. So this is the low sodium. So what, what you have to do, you have to know the ingredients you're working with. Mm -hmm. So if you're using something that already has salt in it, use this. If you know it doesn't have much, it doesn't have much salt or no salt at all. Yes. These two are going to do it because remember, the first ingredient is sea salt. Mm -hmm. So you already have your salt here. Mm -hmm. You don't have to add any salt. Yeah. So, guys, this mm. is lunch. Yeah, you're gonna you're gonna have it good now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And let me see if I can show everything now. Oh wow! Looking good. Mm -hmm. Ooh, your husband will love it, Candice. Yeah, this is a good lunch oh. right there. Ooh. So, welcome to the good life. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Saints, hey, listen, listen, you, if you, if you are, if you choose to eat plant based, you don't, you don't necessarily have to. Your food doesn't have to be bland. You know, I've heard a lot of people saying, "Oh, man, I try to make this; it's all bland." Again, it's your, it's your seasoning that you're using. Mm -hmm. Let me ask you a question, Candice. I forgot what you said about the meatballs. Did you bake it or... Air fry it. Oh, air fry. I used air fryer. Okay, 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 air fryer. Yeah. Okay. Air because fryer. Um, I found that if you, if you bake it or you fry it, sometimes it falls apart. Mm -hmm. So the air fryer just gives it the heated meat mm -hmm. to just give it that cooked feeling and you're good to go. Mm -hmm. that's that's what it is this is encouraging me to eat more veggies because i'll be honest with you at first vegetables kind of was a bland taste to me mm -hmm. but now that i have the seasonings that are healthy i know it's not going to have any effect on me in a negative way i added it in and voila Mm hmm And you know what? You can do you can do um asparagus as well. Oh asparagus, Ooh. yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Yes. It's very good. Mm. It's very, oh, very, very put a little good. put a little butter on it. On it, just oh. like she did it. Oh mm -hmm. yeah, asparagus. Asparagus is very good. That's one of my favorite. Yeah. yeah. That's one of I'm my favorite. I'm gonna see if I could bring it closer so you all could see. Sure. So these are the three that made it mm -hmm. to China mm. <laughs> Wow, yeah. that's very good. Very good, very good. Very good. Very good. This Candace. is very proud. We're very proud of our sister here. I think mm. they should put the word chef in front of your name now. Yeah. <laughs> I, have, I have to thank my cousin. She helped me, you know, cook up, um, cut up all the stuff. And she's like, okay, you do your, you do your stuff from there. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, yeah. um, I think in food prep, you need to be able to take out all the stuff you want to use, mm -hmm. cut up everything from beforehand so that it makes it easier. Sometimes we get to enough from cooking because of the process. But if we could do things to make the process worthwhile, it's nicer. So example, when I'm doing the tofu, I make sure I let it um, sit on some paper towel so that it will drain mm -hmm. because if it has the more moisture it has in it, it's harder for the flavors to find its way. Mm -hmm. It's almost like the good, good seasoning experience in the Great Flood. Mm -hmm. And you don't want that, yeah. right? Yeah. Right? You want it to pass through the Red Sea. You want it to be able <laughs> pass to, through the Red you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what I did is that I drained the tofu mm -hmm. and then I have the masher. You know what I used to, to mash the masher? Potatoes. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. I mash it. I put some... Um, I put some turmeric, right? Sprinkle the turmeric. And I use these two, mm -hmm. which is the Caribbean all-purpose seasoning, right? And let me tell you why I use this. Because this have the nutritional use, um, nutritional yeast flakes in mm -hmm. it and pepper. Mm -hmm. And this gives it not just the color, but it gives it this sort of cheesiness mm -hmm. that's natural. And what it also does it reminds you of scrambled egg, but it's tofu. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I use the chicken style because we know eggs and chicken, you know, they go hand in hand. Mm -hmm. So just to get that taste, you can use this. I know a lot of people use um, black Himalayan salt, 
like I, I don't know much about it yeah but yeah it's they said it's like an egg, egg replacement mm-hmm. it's a yes but this is it right here mm-hmm. right here. i have to shake it for you all to hear it <laughs> right here so that's what i do and that's an easy breakfast you all you do that yeah you slice up your, your whole wheat bread you toast it you put your natural butter Mm-hmm. Right, mm-hmm. Yeah, balanced butter, and you have your um scrambled tofu, yeah. and that's breakfast. And some yeah. fruits to the side. Yeah, Ooh. yeah. Side. yeah. yeah a little yogurt if you want. Put in there a little granola, mm-hmm. and yeah, you're good to go. And um, this this is this is what it feels like. These are very good for soups as well. Mm-hmm. If you make a soup. The flavor your soup with this, you don't need to go back to those pack things. That right. looks like we're not too sure. Question mark, question mark, mm-hmm, question mark. Mm-hmm. And um, so yeah, yo, this is my um presentation. Awesome, awesome. Um, the the yes. The cauliflower, um, the broccoli and the cauliflower, um, with with the nice rich taste. And of course, your season or garlic potatoes. Yes. Amen. Tastyeden.com, uh, folks. Tastyeden.com. Go ahead yeah. and, 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 and go on there. Um, get yours. Very important. Get yours. Go on there. Uh, Tastyeden.com. We, uh, you know, we are so happy to have our sister. Uh, somebody on, uh, on YouTube says, the food look very good, Candice. Yummy. <laughs> 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 Well, I wonder is, who is that? It's uh, Heal My Marriage podcast. I don't know. Oh, they are in the UK. Oh. Yeah, okay. okay. Oh, yes. Well, welcome. Yes. Thank you for watching. Yes. <laughs> and those on you on the UK, uh, you you should be able to order it. If uh, yeah, and even on Amazon too, you should be able to get it. That. There it is. There it is. Show off, Candice. There it is. Good stuff. <laughs> you know what? I'm showing off. I'm showing off you because you look like cooking. It's so simple. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yes. Yes. Very, very, very but, good. But um, y'all, don't call me to cater because I'm not there yet, right? <laughs> you can call Tasty Eater. They do all the catering. Yeah. I know my lane. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we do catering as yeah. well. Yeah. If, for if folks out there yeah. looking for, uh, if you have a wedding or you have a, if you want some plant based uh, 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 cake, some nice cake, and we're talking now. We're talking good cake. We're not talking. I can't even explain. I'm talking about good <laughs> cake. If you want something like this, yes, we can, we can work something out uh, with you. And if any, if anybody from church would watch in, right? Mm-hmm. Um, just go easy on me. Don't say, Sister Candace, <laughs> next time I need to bring some food. <laughs> <laughs> you know that's coming. <laughs> yeah. So, so basically, I used um one full head of cauliflower, one full head of the broccoli. I use one pack of the Beyond um, Beyond Beef um, vegan plant-based balls, and I use one pack of potatoes, and that was it. One, 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 one. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, that was nice. Yeah, for folks who you know, folks who cook for the churches. Listen, you can buy, you can contact us, and we can arrange something where you can get this in bulk and save more money. Mm-hmm. If you you know, if you cook for a lot of people, like for churches, you want to give the folks something at least you can. You know, you know that uh, well uh, healthier for them. So yeah, we can we can work something out. You know, we can we sell by bulk as well. Uh, you get you get a special discount, special pricing when you buy them by bulk. So contact us again, okay? number four two three five six seven zero five six eight four two three five six seven zero five six eight. Or you go to uh, tastyeden.com. You can contact us from there as well. Okay, tastyeden.com, you can contact us uh, on there as well. So don't forget, Saint, you can uh, go on our website, you can subscribe, uh, so you do not miss this wonderful, uh, wonderful seasoning. Uh, we're so happy that, uh, uh, you know, uh, Sister Candice was able to, uh, uh, you know, show us some good things that she, she was able to cook with, uh, with the seasoning. Would you, would you, now let me ask this question for you. Would you recommend these based on your use of it? Or your experience, would you recommend these to others and why? Cost effective, simple to use, 
it's a support in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. It's a kitchen aid <laughs> and it's a healthier option. And I believe that persons who are transitioning um, to plant-based, it is something that will help you not miss the artificial flavors that mm -hmm. you're used to, but it will usher you into a new season of healthy living. Mm. And um, you all know I love to eat. So I'm not making this thing up. And um, what I like, it's you can also subscribe and you don't have to worry about, oh my gosh, I'm out of seasoning. When do mm -hmm. I get it? Mm -hmm. And what I like about this, how you know it's good and healthy, you don't use you don't need to use much. Some of the other seasonings, sometimes you, you keep on pouring, pouring, and you have to wait a while before you get the flavoring you need. So this is going to last you a while. But just in case that you run out, you don't want to run out of anything. You want to be able to have it at hand. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, mm -hmm. yes, 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 definitely. Yes. Most definitely. Well, um, yeah, I'll definitely recommend it. Um, you know, there's so many other things I could do on a Sunday and I could probably just be somewhere else. But I really want the persons to know that this works. And I'm a testimony. Like if any of my family there, you all could tell them, yeah. Candice, Candice need a, little, a lot of help in the kitchen. And the fact that she's able to move from point A to point B mm -hmm. using the best. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's Thank that's you. that's a very that's very good point. So, mm -hmm. folks out there, you don't have to be a chef. Mm -hmm. You know, this is like she said, is a, a kitchen aid. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like that. Yeah, that's <laughs> a, it's a, it's a kitchen aid. It, it helps you in the kitchen. Okay, so we moving on to the last word because we have to. Uh, I know you have to let her go and, and enjoy this tasty meal. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, for those watching, if you were to have you know last words of encouragement. To the viewers, um, uh, maybe folks, uh, you know, if you were to encourage folks to, to, to buy it, I know you've mentioned that already, uh, and, and and encourage others, you know, who might have used it already, uh, you know, other ways that they can use it and stuff like that. So, in other in other words, you know, last words of encouragement to others uh, watching out there uh, before we before we finished. Yeah, sure. So. I know a lot of persons, they might be into catering or they love, like we in the Caribbean, we love to invite a lot of family over. Mm -hmm. There are certain family members, they don't know it as yet, but they might be sensitive to MSG. They mm -hmm. might be sensitive to a lot of the additives. And this has no artificial colors. Mm -hmm. um, it's calorie free, fat free, cholesterol free. And I know like... We might have family members who are elderly and they can't have certain things, but this helps you to not compromise on taste and not compromise on your health, as we said before. And um, what I will say to you all is at the end of the day, because sin entered the world, mm. a lot of things are contaminated, right? Mm -hmm. It's not the way God intended it to be. Mm -hmm. And if you're not there yet, soon enough, we need to go back to Eden. And this is where Tasty Eden comes in, this plant-based cooking method. You want to be able to use this. And for those who are saying, I'm running out of recipes, I don't know what to do, they are coming out with a cookbook very soon. Yes. So they are here to support you in every way possible. And if you have any questions, you go to them on Instagram at Tasty Eden and just tell them, hey, I'm struggling. I'm having a hard time with X, Y, Z. And they'll tell you exactly what to do. Yes. And... Finally, I believe um, this, by, this, this body is a temple, right? And, mm -hmm. and that's what resides. And, you know, if we could create the most healthy and natural environment for, you know, um, the Lord to work through us, I think we're going to have a better ministry. We're going to have a better life. And we're going to have happier families. So I am a living testimony that cooking can be made simple and tasty and effective. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm just happy about this. Thankful for the opportunity. And you know, God answers prayer. So yes. if you're wondering, God, what to do? Mm. God saw it first. That's yeah. right. That's what Thank you, right. Candice. Thank you. Can do. Thank you. Yeah, we, we are eternally grateful uh, to you, uh, Candice, for... Um, accepting to come on and let me say anyone out there watching and you've purchased these uh, seasonings 
and you like to demonstrate you know how you use them hey contact us yeah this is open know. this is open form <laughs> contact us hey you can because we, what we're finding is we're learning Mm-hmm. As yeah, we're learning as people are demonstrating. Yeah. I'm learning myself because folks have different ways of, of cooking. Especially things, yeah. we, we have different. Di- we have different folks from different countries, mm-hmm. different culture. Folks use these things differently. So and, and not only they they are demonstrating, and also you get new um, recipes. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, you get to mm-hmm. learn new stuff. Mm-hmm. You know, new way of of cooking certain things yeah you know so yep. that's very good that that definitely so again uh we want to thank everyone uh everybody who you know who are on here supporting uh those watching wherever you're watching us from so we just want to thank you um uh we just want to thank you for the uh, for the support we, we praise god you know god is good uh, we can't complain we can't complain at all god is good you know always there to uh, show us way the way to go so mm-hmm. we we really thank god and we again thank our sister sister candace thank you so much she's, um oh yeah she's, she's showing something here uh hold on don't go yet don't go yet the people uh, there it is there it is so thank you yeah thank you very much sister thank you for this uh, tasty stuff yes yeah i'm sure it's, it's like especially the potato because i know how good these potatoes come out when you mm-hmm. use the seasonings on these Oof. potatoes oh and i it looks know good mm-hmm. 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 yep <laughs> yep i know exactly what you mean sister yeah again thank you thank you everybody uh for watching uh join us um uh we'll see you on the website yes right we'll, we'll see you we'll see you on the website folks uh, don't don't be afraid um, don't be afraid um, go on there um, put in put in your orders okay put in your orders uh, again we do have the uh, uh, subscription going on right now mm-hmm. with, it's we're always gonna have it but right now it's special pricing special discounts so and, Saints and if and if, if and if someone wanna buy wanna buy it to try it before you subscribe you can always do so yes you will have discounts um, yep. online as well yep you can always do that thank you everybody thank you sister Candice for watching we'll see you on the other side of the website t- tastyeden.com yes we thank everybody we'll see you next time bye bye au revoir bye, bye. <laughs>